Hi Taurus, welcome to Omkara Tarot and to your weekly energy read for you and yours. That That is you and the person who's affecting your energy the most at this time. Uh, Taurus, these are general readings, so each and every reading is not going to be uh, resonating with all you Taurians out there. So please take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin Taurus. Dear God, Goddesses, Angels, Spirit Guides, please send Taurus the message they need to hear the most at this time. Thank you. So Taurus, two sets of cards, one for you and for one for the person who's affecting your energy the most at this time and how to navigate around that energy. Okay, so these are not specific love readings. Uh, this could be anyone who's uh, around you, someone on your mind, uh, someone you're attached to could be your parent, boss, child, neighbor, boss. So, And also I'll be reading one side as you and one side as the other person. Use a discernment to see which side you resonate on. Also Taurus, I have an announcement. I have successfully completed the first month of being on this channel. And as a big thank you to all of you who sent me so much love, I am going to be offering three card free readings to all my subscribers. So just send me, uh, if you have a question, uh, shoot me a mail at uh, omkaratarot at gmail.com with your question and your name. I'll be happy to do a reading for you. So let's go into your cards, Taurus. The first card I have is the Four of Swords, <clears throat> Three of Cups, Five of Cups, Seven of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Page of Cups. For your person, I have the Knight of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, Ace of Cups, Ace of uh, Pentacles, the Nine of Swords, and the Hermit in Reverse. And for your mutual energy, I have the Eight of Cups in Reverse, Justice in Reverse, and the King of Cups. Bottom of the deck, I also have the Queen of Cups. So let's see, Taurus, what the cards want to say today. From person A, Taurus, I see someone who's feeling a bit depressed right now, feeling a bit worn down, possibly wanting to take a little break. Something that they were trying to, you know, passionately move towards. It could be work, it could be business. Uh, that really didn't take off and they feel uh, it was probably a waste of time and uh, whatever they tried to do, you know, it kind of backfired. It didn't really lead them to the satisfaction level that they were, they were wanting. I have the Nine of Cups in reverse as well. They're not feeling very satisfied by the way that things turned out. They were really hoping for something to work out, but you know, somebody either created some mischief in this dynamic or this could be a business plan, could be whatever. And they, they now feel that they have to put this down to rest. And they're feeling a bit sad about, you know, what what went down and what didn't work out. Um, the, the person A is actually feeling it, it was probably a waste of time. And uh, they also feel rather upset and angry about it. Not only depressed, sad, angry, uh, feeling that they, you know, whatever they were trying to work on, it just didn't pan out the way they hoped it would. This is the kind of feeling, you know, if the person A feels it's over and there's no, uh, it's come to a stop now. Like whatever they had in mind, whatever they wanted to work on, it just, just, you know, they put in a lot of work. There's, look at this man working so hard trying to build something up, but this is in reverse. So some project or some, uh, idea that you person A had now Taurus whether this is you or the other person I don't know but person A feels that whatever they worked really hard to do some secrets came out something got known maybe someone uh, you know uh, told them something which ups was upsetting and made them feel that all the progress that they thought they were making really didn't work and uh, here it is the ace of swords in uh, reverse as well nothing really kind of there's no clear cut uh, forward uh, path left for them whatever they were wishing for or person a whatever they felt they were wishing for they haven't been able to achieve 
achieve that goal and uh, they try very hard to see things from a higher perspective to see what else is out there but right now i think uh, person a is almost like you know in a hangman situation he's trying very hard he or she is trying very hard to see this from a different perspective and uh, try and find something good that they can find in all the past efforts that were made in the situation but yes they feel now they feel betrayed and they feel uh, you know they kind of lost they feel um, they, f- they feel they lost us and nothing really worked out in their favor see again this this is uh, this knight of uh, king of wands is someone in the upright which is like forward movement fast movement uh, but this is also in reverse so the person a is feeling little dejected they're feeling a little you know out in the cold uh, not having been you know not whatever they they were trying to build towards has probably come to a stop and i guess this is the time for this uh, covid-19 and a lot of people are facing a lot of problems in their work as well so that could be a case here where somebody was really you know starting something and this happened and right now they are sad okay person 1 now person 2 person 2 here is in the knight of pentacles energy knight of pentacles is also kind of a very slow energy but they are this is still a bit hopeful because it seems like uh, it's slow but solid ground they are also hurt okay they are also hurt they realize that you know because this movement has not been as fast as um, you know the, they expected it's led to a lot of heart heartbreak heart pain but i don't think they really want to uh, turn back okay uh, they, i mean sorry they don't want to move away they don't want to move away from uh, even the thought of this not working out why i say this is because i have the eight of cups in the mutual energy as well so i don't i mean as much as as disappointed as you people are right now both of you i don't think you really want to turn your back on it either either on each other or this project that you were trying to do um person b looks a bit more hopeful than person 1 they still feel that okay even if you know the pentacles or whatever didn't happen or this project didn't go through at least uh, we have emotional satisfaction between the two of us and we still have love between the two of us um they at least trying to portray that okay heart of hearts i see person b also in a nine of swords energy they they have been very worried they've also been you know sitting up all night and worrying about it but person b is a bit more optimistic okay they are trying to get out of this energy they are trying to concentrate on the love and the forward movement that po- you know is possible in this and also on the 10 of cups which is again emotional satisfaction that can be you know achieved at this point and if they have been thinking or worrying about this they want to uh, they, they they want to kind of come forward to you with at least a small message of let's you know let's let's get out of this hermit mode okay if both of you have been in your shells or worrying and uh, yeah just worried just worried and upset this person wants to bring back some level of happiness uh, some level of uh, optimism into this uh, place that you both seem to find yourself in right now yes person b is really really being optimistic they are trying to release all the stress and worry which is has entered your lives i think at the moment and even though there was no uh, maybe financial transaction here maybe in your business or whatever happened here there was no balance in the pentacles or no balance in the give or give and take the this person is trying to now release the stress from that okay and they are hoping for a rebirth they are really hoping that after this you know whatever time you guys are going through things will get better and uh, you have to just kind of keep a balance okay now is the time not to give up but just to keep a balance in your life and maybe take charge and take control of whatever you guys have left so that you know soon happier times are possible they are also trying to get out of this hermit mode uh, spirit can we have a card for the hermit mode uh, for person b yes they're releasing okay so if you people have been in a situation where you felt 
that maybe something was really tight and you know you people were oh, there maybe there was financial trouble here and uh, you felt you know there, there was not enough to go by person b is releasing that uh, stress uh, it's no point uh, money pinching let's say or holding back emotions depends you know you all have different situations so from what i see it's, it's probably a, you know work related but this could pertain to a relationship as well so this person is releasing that stress and worry anything else for it for person b they also know right now there is you know no possibility of a fresh new start okay but they have decided definitely to bring love into the situation and release all this stress and worry regarding this you know see they had this card earlier as well you know they were also looking forward to this ace of pentacles with you okay even though they realize that right now it's not possible person b is trying to look at the bright side of things and in a loving manner and release all the stress so let's see what is in your mutual mutual energy here in the mutual energy i see the 8 of cups eight of cups is uh, you know the i think both of you have realized that you have no control over the situation okay and you have to just kind of you both feeling maybe weak at this point knowing that you know nothing is secure nothing is um, stable at the moment but you both don't want to totally lose hope or walk away from it either whatever has been done wrong something you both feel some injustice has been done in the past some injustice happened between the two of you or with the two of you which put everything into a very very stagnant energy things just came to a standstill stop so that's how both of you are feeling this week i guess but i also have the 10 of cups and of course we saw the uh, queen of cups so this is like a perfect pair okay king of cups and the queen of cups there is still a lot of love between both of you and i think both of you are trying to build on that okay so you both are trying to maybe uh, keep each other's spirits up at this point or give hope to each other for whatever didn't happen and uh, concentrate on on this on the emotional satisfaction of counting your blessings maybe at this point to you know find happiness where you can find it and this is a great pair the king of cups the queen of cups and the two of cups oops i dropped a card i'll just pick it up and here she is again the two to the queen of cups is here back again so like i said i have the king of cups here okay i had it here at the bottom of my deck and the queen of cups says no i'm not at the bottom of the deck i'm right here with my king so she came flying out again okay and that's leading to this beautiful two of cups so this week i think you both are going to leave all the stress all the pain behind and concentrate on ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, so there's going to be some communication. Okay, there's going to be some communication of whatever happened in the past, which was uh, not really a good thing to happen. Maybe uh, you felt cheated out of your time, energy, money, anything. And there's going to be some solid communication regarding that this. And I think this week both of you are going to come out of this hermit mode and you know just thinking and. you know feeling sad about it and i think this is the week to bring back what you have and which is beautiful you have the king of cups queen of cups and the two of cups so this is in your mutual energy this week taurus which is great and see now you both are this week i think you're going to both make a decision to sail away into karma waters okay so let's see what the angels have for you taurus Taurus before this reading ends you probably see a little blue uh, logo icon of omkara if you could please click that for me you'll be a subscriber and then if you have any question please send me a mail on my email and i'll try and help you as much as i can so the angel card i have for you taurus you're a leader okay so now instead of uh, feeling sorry for yourself you not just you i think both of you 
have to take the lead to find the best possible solution to uh, getting rid of whatever you know sadness you people are feeling and maybe start again okay whatever you were working on which you felt you were not getting good results in, uh, angels are saying the universe is saying don't worry whatever progress you've made was steady and that's not going to go anywhere continue continue hoping and working on that and uh, trust yourself that once things get better you are going to be a winner stay committed to whatever goals and dreams that you have okay and also commit to yourself and your loved ones and use this time wisely so love and light take care taurus see you soon